Good morning! Time for some vlogging. Hoffman's Mineral Vlog. It's time to vlog again. It's Wednesday, June 9th, 2021. We're going to have a great day today. We're going to have an outstanding day. And we're going to start the day with a bottle of Uludag all the way from Turkey. I'm looking on a map here at where the Uludag mineral water plant is. It's near the Sea of Mamara, which um, I never really knew. There's a lot I don't know. Uh, so, uh, you know, the little isthmus of Turkey, which I think is called the, the Straits of Dardanelles. Is that what that is? I remember that from history. So there's the Aegean Sea <clears throat> on the west, which we know a lot about uh, from, you know, um, uh, Clash of the Titans. And then there's the Black Sea on the east, and that's very famous too. But there's like a little extra sea, which I never really knew about until today. Maybe that's very ignorant of me, but that's the way it is. Uh, and it's called the Sea of Mar Marmara. The Sea of Marmara is like an extra sea. And when you're in Istanbul, as I've never been and have always wanted to go, uh, in fact, you're, the water um, that surrounds you is, uh, is the Sea of Marmara. Uh, and then it's the the river that goes through the middle of Istanbul is called. Uh, I'm not even going to try. Chorn oh, uh, Chornomarsk Derinche, probably, or possibly, and that's the river that separates the west of Istanbul, and then you go to the east of Istanbul, and then you got the giant landmass of Turkey that goes all the way and connects to Syria and. Um, and Armenia and Iran and it's great it's great because it gives us an opportunity to try out some ulu dog all right big ups to my friend Bilga Ibire maybe he has memories on a hot summer day of drinking some ulu dog and watching a good movie in his words let's hear if this is good water let's hear for the all right no no carbonation at all this is a sparkling Natural spring water. Maybe it isn't a sparkling. What do I know? We're going to find out right now. This is not a sparkling water. This is a very cold, refreshing water with a lot of mineral taste. Oh, man, this is... Ugh, I'm on a hot day. I'm walking. I'm walking and talking like I'm in a... Um, in a Nuri Bilge Chelan film, talking about philosophy, going to those houses in in the movie where the boy threw a rock at the window, and then he the guy talks to the father for an hour and a half, and then after he's done talking, he's to refresh himself. Oh my God, this is hot stuff. It's really good. Um, it is not bitter. It is not bitter. It has a, but it has a full spectrum of flavor. Very, very, you know, you give this to some, well, I mean, it's funny. I, I want to say you give this to somebody and they think, wow, this is different, but it's, it's, <laughs> it's not that dissimilar from one of the great waters of all time, New York City tap water. It's as good as New York City tap water. What does it say on the back here? <coughs> um, <clears throat> produced by Urbak Uludag. I'm sure I'm mispronouncing that, and I apologize. I know that the Turkish language has uh, their letters don't automatically make the sound that we think they make. The letter C, for example, in Turkish, I know is 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 like a J. That's the way they want to do it. That's cool with me, man. I'm not, I'm not telling them what to do. There's actually some Hebrew writing on the back of this. Unbelievable. There's a lot of Hebrew writing here. I mean, it's got the little circle K, which means it's kosher. But there's a lot of Hebrew writing here. Um, and some French. <clears throat> yeah. Oh, man. This is a big win. 
<clears throat> I mean, look, I would never buy it. I mean, look, it's it, it's silly because I do have a prejudice for sparkling water versus flat. It's silly to import water. This whole exercise, this whole mineral vlog is ridiculous. There's really no reason to import water. Um, it's bad for the environment. It's bad for everybody. But I can sort of understand that when I drink a bottle of wonderful Gerolsteiner from Germany, I recognize that that's a, that's a taste I'm not really going to get anywhere else. Um, when it comes to flat water for me, I mean, this is good. This is a great bottle of flat water. I love it. You know, it's a different, like I said, I go to my tap, I fill up a bottle, I put it in the fridge for an hour. I've said enough. I'm going to assume that Ulu Dog also has a sparkling. And if they do, and I see it, I'm going to try it. The Ulu Dog website, by the way, um, has some really cool, uh, th this, this bottled water has been around for a century. It, it boasts. And some of the old bottles are really quite beautiful. These blue, I wish I could get a bottle of the blue glass Uludag. Um, but I did say it was something funny when it was telling you, um, yeah, get some good, uh, rich in calcium, strengthens bones, magnesium, beneficial for the heart and blood vessels, bicarbonate aids the stomach and digestive system. And fluoride strengthens teeth. That's the sparkling. So the sparkling is in a green bottle with a really very nifty late 60s, early 70s type font. Uh, and a vis an image of like a, the mountain range and whatnot. Why don't we get me some of that? If I can find the, the sparkling in the, in the green bottle, you damn right I'm going to grab some. Damn right. Ulu Dog. It's probably pronounced something different. Ulu Dash or something. I apologize to my Turkish friends for mispronouncing it. It's in the and the G has a um, an accent on the top. Mm. This is a this is a tasty. Maybe I would get this, like if it became a thing, you know, like uh, outside of just the one specialty store. Like suddenly you started like. You know, one day we woke up in the 90s and Fiji water was everywhere. You know, if suddenly Uludach, Uludig, I don't know how to pronounce it, were to show up, um, then I would grab it. Be like, oh, yeah, we always grab the Uludag. This is great. Hats off. Um, all right, big day today, but I'm going to cut it short. I hope you're enjoying these mineral vlogs. Today's a Wednesday. Tomorrow we got something fun on tap. Ha! Huh. And then the day after that is a big day, a day we've been waiting for. Um, all right. Keep on keeping on today. Keep doing your best. Rock and roll. And we'll see you next time. Where's the button? There it is.